In today's video, we will unbox together another Cartier jewelry piece. You guys know I love Cartier. I love most of their pieces, including this necklace that I have mentioned to you in the past. But I couldn't decide to buy for a sensible reason. And I'm talking about the Diamond Leger or Diamor, which is the new name of the necklace. Why I defer getting it? Stay tuned. Before I share my short story with you about this piece and why I didn't buy it right away the moment I saw it in the boutique, I'm just going to unbox it first because I'm super super excited already. I know you are too. So here's my new Cartier purchase. I just want to mention that every time I shop at Cartier, I'm always satisfied with my whole shopping experience. If my SA was not available, all the other SAs were always there to assist me. Everyone has been very accommodating. The only issue I have with Cartier was the inavailability of essential things that I think should come with each piece of jewelry like the travel pouch and cleaning kit. Anyway, we have a nice paper bag with a Cartier ribbon tied to it. We have a white envelope with blank card. In case you want to give the item as a gift. We have the receipt. The certificate of authenticity. Its jewelry piece has an engraved serial number on it, which should match with that of your authenticity card. And finally, the classic box within a box. Beautiful packaging, right? When you push this button, it's supposed to pop open. And here we are, my Diamore necklace. Oh, it's beautiful. It's the large model. It's in 18 karat yellow gold with a brilliant cut diamond pendant totaling 0 0.19 karat.
in a while I'm going to try the necklace on so you can see how it looks on me oops spoiler alert <laughs> I just want to share with you my outfit of the day, what I'm wearing at the moment. It's this black dress. It's not actually short. It's just above the knee. I kind of like the black background. Oh, it's like floating in the dark or floating necklace. When I unboxed my Cartier Love necklace, three diamonds, I did mention that I was supposed to pick the Diamond Regi but changed my mind because I've learned that the Diamond Pendant is actually an illusion. Yeah, it's an illusion setting. That was according to my SA when I verified the diamond use for the pendant. I just had a gut feeling when I was carefully looking at the stone at the time. It made me disappointed because I was ready to buy one at the time. I've always wanted the necklace because I thought it's cute, very sparkly, and that's the reason why they call it Spotlight. And it's perfect for layering. But because it's an illusion setting, I backed out and I told myself to think about it more. So I chose this Love Necklace 3 Diamonds instead. This Love Necklace 3 Diamonds is way pricey than the, the Amor Necklace. But I knew it was worth it. I just posted a video about it. It's my one year review of this necklace. And if you haven't watched that, I'm going to put the link up here. Anyway. The Diamorce diamond look like a big diamond, but it's not one. You will know that it's made of a cleverly crafted metal or a cluster of smaller diamonds. With the existing price of this necklace, you can already buy two or three necklaces with the same look and materials. First of all, the illusion setting like this uses more metal than diamonds, which they call bezel. So this makes it more affordable, supposedly. But Cartier is Cartier. It's the king of jewelry. So we're paying for its historical significance, prestige, and craftsmanship. Despite the cons and everything, after a year of contemplating, I still purchased this necklace. It looks really dainty, sparkly, even the chain. It goes well with anything and everything. It's a great layering piece like I mentioned. Since I picked the large size, I can wear it on its own. The chain is more substantial than the extra small and small. There's no medium size for this model or collection, so it prevents the pendant from moving around too much. I finally decided to add it to my collection because it's Cartier, period. <laughs> Let me know what are your thoughts about the Diamore necklace. I love reading your comments, you know. And if you enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!